That means only three cylinder working on my car. The power is lower and car shaking a lot and it's not easy to drive it. And also you can hear it from exhaust that the car, the engine doesn't work properly. So, one cylinder is dead. One by one, each one. First, we find out which one, which of these cylinder doesn't work. We have four cylinder. One, two, three, four. One of these cylinder doesn't work. So first, we we found out. So we slowly we take that one out. As you see, this is working good. Very hard. See? No change. That's me. Cylinder number one, two, three doesn't work. Push back. Something wrong with here. Do you hear it? And this working also. See? Okay, we found problem here. We check the power coming or not. And you can check your rescue diver here or see no spark. Something wrong with here or with the wire. Because we don't have a spark. Could be this could be this coil is damaged. So this is good. Only we we have a problem with that one, so should replace it probably. I will check this harness also. It's some damage on this harness. Okay, I have a coil here now with me. And I'm going to replace the coil and test. Yes, it is. It's good. Easily here. See, 
is a clips that you open and close and this will come out this is the original wheel I will replace it with that one I both not so expensive it's about 180 coronas mean about $50 part number is here if you want there you want buy it it's a golf Okay, I start the car again. You see, voila. See, motor totally changed. All four cylinder working now. We can maybe test it. See, if you take that on easily. Out. You take that one out. You see. See? It's different now. It's a sparking and working. So the problem was this coil. Good. Ah. No, all four cylinder working. Cylinder number three. We had a problem with and we replaced the coil and we can take a look at the exhaust now. See, as you say, the exhaust doesn't show not so bad, so yeah, no problem. So the car, the car is from three cylinder to four cylinder. We can put back everything. Okay, it was an easy fix and uh, no problem with this. Hopefully with the engine we found except the coil we replaced on this car. So everything is good. Okay, as you see, we fixed the problem. As you see, they fixed the problem with replacing only the coil. But uh, in some cases, as I told you, the problem could be bigger, could be the valve, could be the piston, could be the uh, gasket, head gasket and the car and other things. But most of the case could be the small things that you can replace and fix the car. So before decide to run a workshop, so check the basic and small uh, things on your car as you know. Uh, to find the problem, save money and uh, time. Okay, after replacing the coil, so engine light is uh, still there, is not going away uh, before you reset it. So how we can reset it? Uh, for reset the engine light, you need the diagnostic tool, uh, uh, and you connect it here.
very and it's doing is good Uh, do you have any question regarding this video let me know uh, comment below on there uh, i can help you as much as i can thank you very much for watching this video and have a great time